What's up, everybody? How you doing? This is Max Boogie from Wall Street. Week 17, the last game of the season. Daniel Taylor still wilding on this single back ace, HB counter. The offensive line still blocking that right. Roddy White still holding his block long enough, just enough, so we can get the first down, and that's it. But um, two back-to-back -back first downs. We're going to run it up the middle, fighting for the extra yards like we always do. But, like, this is the last game of the season. It's been a long one. I didn't think it would take this long to get to the end. But, you know, I haven't uploaded these a lot. Like, I haven't been uploading them a lot. But I did. But, like, I didn't at the same time. Like, I, I did for a couple of days. And then I stopped for a whole bunch of days. And you know how it goes. But, fourth and one, man, we go for it just because. Two people don't even want to tackle Daniel Taylor, but that's all right. You can let him score. You know what I'm saying? We, we let, they just let Daniel Taylor score. Thomas Day cool. Let him score. I hate Thomas Day cool. <laughs> Former Falcon, but this little glitch, I got way more than one rushing touchdown. I broke the record, so they just only put one. But Thomas Day cool is a former Falcon, and uh, he was just soft. You know what I'm saying? That's a play that he would probably do in real life. You know what I'm saying? He's a, he, I guess he's a good safety. He's a good cover safety, but he was just real soft. We ended up releasing him like two seasons ago. Cam Newton doesn't know what to do with the ball. He's getting sacked. Quincy Boy in that first play stopped the running back in the backfield. Single-handedly, Cam Newton again getting sacked, put on his back. We are not playing around in this first quarter. It's 7-0. We get the ball back. Holes is just too big. The, the Panthers' defense is, oh, my God. Can, who, how are we going to get stopped in the playoffs? You know what I'm saying? Daniel Taylor's not even... He's not even in full try-hard mode, and he's already he's fading Luke Kuechly and whatever else is on their defense. I think Greg Hardy is still on there, too. There's not much he can do from a run up the middle in the defense end position. So we get the free run, didn't even have to, we didn't, didn't even get touched right up the middle, and we, we score a touchdown. Again, another first down. But that was basically it for that drive. 14 to 0 in the second quarter, under two minutes left. Quincy Blunt playing the running back. If he were to do it to the running back, that would have been an interception. So what does he do? He's Cam. He's going to scramble out of the pocket. Third and three. Same drive. Quincy Blunt coming in on the blitz, backing up in the coverage. We stopping that again. We just stopping stuff, man. Led them to a fourth down. We get the ball back on offense. They throwing it to Daniel Taylor. Is that day cool again? Yes, it was. We broke his tackle. He was just not that aggressive of a player. That's why we ended up cutting him. But now... We got the new head coach, Dan Quinn, out here making these changes. Quincy Blunt could have been a late helmet-to-helmet -helmet hit if he wanted to, but it didn't. You know, they don't call that, man. They don't really call that unless you out of bounds for unnecessary roughness. Quincy Blunt stuffing up the middle, forcing the running back to go outside. There's no way to run. The middle is not opening again. I think that's Beerman or Stuper. I think 55 is Stuper. 55 gets the tackle. On the line of scrimmage, so uh, another like no game. After the second half, though, we back on offense, 14 to zero. Y'all see, Quincy Blunt is at tight end. <laughs> if y'all remember it in Madden 25, man, Quincy Blunt was playing tight end for the Atlanta Falcons for a couple games. They just wanted to put him in, you know what I'm saying? Who is JJ Watt? I don't know, but Matt Ryan though is not throwing Quincy Blunt the ball. All those three plays, he was exceptionally open. Like it was a good chance he would have caught it. So you know he's mad, man. He, he went up, ran straight to the running back on that play, untouched. He, he, he was mad that Matt Ryan was trolling him. He wasn't throwing him the ball on purpose, I guess. This time, we blowing up the run again. Nowhere to run. We fighting off blocks. It just don't, don't matter. Like it, it don't matter where he tries to run. It's just not happening. Another screen play. What did I tell these teams about running screens against the Atlanta Falcons defense? It's not happening. We back on offense, though. Quincy Blunt, wide open. And the, I, it's, Matt Ryan, the biggest troll of the year. This time, we got Daniel Taylor. We going to do a screenplay. Executed perfectly. Daniel Taylor running with the blocks. Real nice game right there. That's how you got to use your blockers. Keep up with them. Keep them in front of you. Daniel Taylor, he's just smart. He's a smart man for that, man. We coming out with Quincy Blunt again. Could have threw it to me a little bit to the right, but he's a troll. Matt Ryan's a troll. Matty Ice doesn't really like Quincy Blunt being on the offensive side of the ball. Fourth and 13. We kind of open right there, but Matt Ryan takes the sack. Didn't really matter, I guess. He didn't really care about getting hit that play. This time, 
dragging Cam Newton down to the ground. He's six five, two hundred and like twenty or forty pounds, and we just throwing him down with Quincy Blunt. Yeah, that's how strong Quincy Blunt is. You know what I'm saying? Third and seventeen. Thought they was actually gonna get that. I just stopped moving because I thought he was down. But he still kept running. Under two minutes left in the fourth quarter, they still down by two scores. <laughs> Quincy Blunt dives to the ground after that spin move by D'Angelo Williams. And they ended up, I, I messed up. You know, I forgot to click the, the left thumbstick in and get to play a lot. They ended up scoring a touchdown on that play. But 7-14, to 14, Matt Ryan finally throws the ball to Quincy Blunt on that corner route. We get both feet down inbounds. First catch of the season in a long time for Quincy Blunt, man. Coming up, Matt Ryan throws it again. I guess he wants to throw an interception so he doesn't have to throw Quincy Blunt the ball. But fourth and 11, can we get the ball wide open for us at least two seconds? Like, he could have threw that. He didn't. He throws it short of the first down, Julio Jones. Biggest troll of the year. Coming up again on defense. Getting off of the block, taking Cam Newton down. It's another sack on the game. Under a minute left until we are done with the regular season. We were about to blitz, but we see the screen coming again, so it's nothing. Get another sack. Fourth and 27. We blitzing again. Doesn't matter. That's that all Madden cheese I was used to. I don't even know why I didn't tackle him. I don't know why. That's an option of not to tackle him. <laughs> but I don't know, man. Seven seconds left. We still on another passer route. We get the ball. Who is Luke Keekley guarding? I don't know. We get the ball. We get the touchdown with Quincy Blunt, man. Who is J.J. Watt? Who is Luke Keekley? He can't guard me. Linebacker versus linebacker, Quincy Blunt is obviously the better one. Matt Ryan getting hit. Quincy Blunt calling for it. Got the little monster face mask.